Welcome to the fourth video in our video series called Awesome Lesson Planning Made Easy, where you can get strategies and ideas to kick your level of lesson planning up a notch, making it more effective and easy. And it's been so much fun to watch all of the comments come in through Twitter and on the video pages where you've been talking about the different ways that you lesson plan and the ways that some of these ideas are changing how you're able to plan. In our first video, we talked about one simple protocol to help give your lessons some structure using icons and color coding and abbreviation so that you can see all of that data all at a glance. In the second video, we talked about four frameworks that can help to improve the content of the lessons, of the way that you, that, that you actually do your lesson planning. And in the third video, it was all about templates, these three templates that can help you get organized, that can give your lesson planner some superpowers, whether you're planning with a traditional lesson plan book or with digital lesson plans. So how can we plan better lessons without spending tons of extra time and effort? Well, I'm Matt Miller, the author of Ditch That Textbook, the book and the blog and the presentations that have reached tens of thousands of educators in more than 100 countries all around the world. I've spent more than 10 years in the classroom planning my own lessons, and over 10 years, it's been more than 12,000 lesson plans that I've written for individual classes. And with my own lesson plan books, I always ask myself, why? You know, why is it that they give us all of these planning pages at the beginning and the end of the book that don't really help, that we can't actually use? And why is it that they haven't given us some resources to improve our abilities to lesson plan, to give us some strategies and some ideas and some tools that can help us to actually plan better lessons? Well, I took all of those whys and I thought, you know what? It's time to actually create something that does all of that. So I am super excited to introduce to you the Ditch That Textbook Lesson Planner. This can be your weekly lesson planner, and it's got all of these great features that you don't find in normal lesson plan books. It's got a flexible design done in light gray, so you can write over it, and you can draw in lines to designate the number of classes you have and the number of days that you actually have in the week. You can even put an hourly schedule down the side for day-long classes. Plus, there are all these little circles that give you spaces for icons, abbreviation, color coding, you know, the kind of stuff that gives your plans a visual organization so that you can see the data on it easily at a glance. And it can actually help you to plan your lessons for tomorrow or next week or even next year. At the beginning of the book, we have these solid lesson planning frameworks, some actual resources to help you improve the lesson plans that you write. And so you've got great stuff like Webb's Depth of Knowledge, Revised Bloom's Taxonomy, Universal Design for Learning. And the best part is that they're all written in an understandable way that is actually helpful. And of course, in true Ditch That Textbook style, we have tons of practical teaching ideas that you can use in class tomorrow. So on each page, you'll find a link to a blog post to teaching ideas that you can start using right away. At the top, you'll find a digital tool of the week. And these are all digital tools that have really good free plans or are completely free. They're all chosen by me and they're not done with any sponsor influence. Down in the corner, you have a QR code to the Ditch That Textbook blog where we're always publishing new ideas so you can get the latest stuff. And then on the other side, we've got the big picture. So you can start up at the top with a little space for your why and for your goals for the week. And then at the end of the week, you've got a space to reflect. Reflect on what went well, what you can improve on, maybe what you're grateful for, or what you wanna try next year. Of course, it's all bound in a nice durable cover, and there are plenty of notes pages in the back for everything that you wanna keep track of. Are you ready to get your own Ditch That Textbook Lesson Planner? If so, go to ditchplanner.com to get all of these super helpful resources and to get your copy so that you can get started right away. Plus, if you purchase by the end of May, you can get a really nice discount. The book usually costs $18.95, but through May 31st, 
it's going to be discounted more than 20% so that you can get it for $14.95. But you got to move fast. So go to ditchplanner.com for all of those resources and to get your copy of the Ditch That Textbook lesson plan book.